Wizards is at it again. They have announced a new secret layer drop today. It is a single drop this time, and there's a couple of things to talk about. Jake, you ready to jump into this? I'm ready, man. Wizards of the Coast is trying to sell us foil rat colonies, and I'm excited about it. Oh, yeah! Hello and welcome to the day. Thank you for spending your time with us. I'm Jake. I'm Joel. Welcome back to another episode of Jake and Joel are Magic. It is time to talk about rats, 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 rats. But first, if it's your first time here, thank you for watching. We really appreciate it. If you wouldn't mind and you want to stay up to date with the latest decks and strategy for Pioneer, Historic, Commander, Standard, Brawl, you want to talk about MTG Finance, or you just want to see us open some booster packs, make sure you hit that subscribe button before you go. Jake, rats, 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 so rats, many rats, things. rats, rats. What do we got? Yeah, dude, we have uh, another secret layer has dropped. We were just talking about secret layer, but I feel like we should talk about it uh, again since it's becoming the new normal. Um, Maronar, which is a pretty good card. Uh, essentially, we got another product coming in yep. at a 40, 40, 40 US bucks dollar price on sale point. January 27th. 40 bucks, limit 10. Maronar, yeah, pack rat. Ink eyes and five rat colonies. All right, so you're getting eight cards here. Uh, I just mentioned uh, mentioned Marrow Gnawer, and uh, this card is it's like twenty five bucks until the rep the reprint was announced. I yeah. imagine it's going down a little bit from there. The art on these cards <clears throat> is beautiful. Yeah, it's very cute. It's supposed to it. coincide with the year of the rat. It being twenty twenty. I, I mean, go. you know, I, I wasn't very interested when I heard the announcement, when I saw the announcement, this little pack rat holding Chinese lanterns walking through a bamboo forest. I'm like, that's real super cute. I really like yeah, that. Yeah, it's all it's all cute. And I think the art on these is, is really neat. I love um, this festive year of the rat. But what does this mean for uh, the market? of these cards um obviously they're gonna go down but also what does this mean for the market of like new premium alt art foils well wizards of the coast is just going to print them they're just gonna print them to demand you're gonna have a day to buy as many of them as you want or uh actually limit 10 per customer yeah um i can't imagine a lot of people are gonna buy 10 of these but um yeah it's another secret layer product and it's just something to keep in your mind that no card is sacred. As long as it's not on the reserve list, Wizards of the Coast could just con contract some artists that, and that then is, get them to come out. That is the biggest thing for me nowadays. The, the No card is sacred. I mean, we're getting to Zendikar later this year. It would be wild if they had a five set, one of, you know, one fetch land, five fetch lands, five separate fetch lands in a secret lair. But, you know, it's not out of question. You know, I was just saying on Reddit the other day, uh, secret layer fetch lands a hundred dollars. All ten fetch lands. Yeah. New alternate art. Get Noah Bradley to do it or something like that. Or Seb McKinnon, like do like some some crazy weird kind of art. But yeah, I, I think it would open up the price of modern. You know, modern is a format that's kind of struggling right now. Now that uh, Pioneer's really taken off, modern is this format that has a high price barrier and. It does have a lot of diehard fans, yeah. but a lot of people don't want to spend thousands of dollars to have a deck that's competitive. No. Well, the thing is with these secret layers is that last time we found out we had planeswalkers hiding in the bottom of them. Ooh, are we've we going to talk rats. about it? Let's talk about Let's it. Let's talk about it. We've got rats. We've got the color black. We've got sacrifice a rat here. I'm looking for themes. We've got discard a card on this pack rat regenerate there i'm looking for plus one plus so number of any cards so jake what do you think the possibility is that we see specific planeswalkers which ones would you think that we might see well we already talked about it and you know what i think but we're gonna reveal it to all of our watchers. Uh, no, it's uh, I, I really do think that the money card of this, we'll just go ahead and start right off with the money card, is gonna be Liliana Dreadhorde General. Yep. And keep in mind, these are gonna be the Planeswalkers that were not used during that first run of Secret Layer products. So only uh, a little bit more than half of the Planeswalkers were used, I believe. Mm -hmm. And so uh, Liliana didn't show up, 
Davriel didn't show up right. and Obnixilis did not show up as options in those first. And and so I do believe that those are probably going to be the Planeswalkers that we see as options if they decide to use those Planeswalkers from War of the Spark. Yeah, there was a little bit of a thematic thing with the associations last time, which Planeswalker went into which layer. Um, this set, as I was pointing out, it's got some sacrifice, got some discard, kind of built in, some creature, you know, destruction a little bit. And so Obnixilis, Davriel, and Liliana are kind of along those lines, and so they would make sense. Yeah, I think that they would make sense. I'll be very surprised if... Um... For some reason, this secret layer doesn't have something special, something hidden. I'm really excited as well, and I think we should talk about the way that they package this product. Is it going to be the same white box that could be tampered with on the bottom, or is it going to be a sealed product? That's something that we'll definitely have to review once the product comes out and we're able to uh, to have it in our hands and talk about it. Yeah, absolutely. I agree. Let us know if you are going to be buying the Rats secret layer. We are interested in seeing people open it here which planeswalkers they got i think that about does it for our secret layer video this time around we appreciate you watching like we said if you would sub if you would hit subscribe if i can say words it would really help us out if you want to support us further we got a patreon the link is down in the description below and if you want to hang out we're streaming on twitch most tuesday and thursday evenings that's all i got i'm tapped out yeah we'll keep it short and sweet baby until next time drop it in the comments what planeswalker do you think is going to be in there have a good weekend